The study is um, a pilot feasi feasibility, so um, we're not going to put a lot of emphasis on the significant differences. We wanted to see if, first of all, we can do it in the lung cancer population. It's a very different population from the COPD uh, general respiratory uh, population. Uh, they go down, as you know, very, very quickly with a lot of symptoms, a lot of problems. Many of them die very soon. Um, so, first of all, we've seen that actually it is feasible. And most importantly, we've seen that uh, it can benefit the patients. Of course, we need now to move to the uh, larger multi-site, bigger trial with about 200 patients. Uh, but uh, the proof of principle is there. Uh, it seems to work very well with the patients. They actually they found it um, very helpful to, to manage the, the distress from br uh, breathlessness. Um, they improved a little bit um, uh, the scores on uh, dyspnea. Uh, and also uh, psychologically they felt much more in control of their disease and many patients have told us anecdotally that actually they, co they could walk longer and they could take more walks and they go shopping something that they didn't do before. Um, the key issue is this is a long-term treatment it's not a one-off uh, that you can do over a few days. Um, the best results were in patients who were using the treatment for about three months.